Hey everybody, we're back with another video. We're going to set up our broker now. And we're, the broker that we're going to use is called Hugo FX. The address is just up here, hugosway.com. Uh, there are a bunch of tabs here, but we just want to sign up. So we're going to sign up either right here or the sign up button. And then you're going to make an account, first name, last name, email, and password and be sure to agree to the terms and conditions. Once you've signed up, you'll get an email, and then from the email, it will take you to the, to the main page. So you need to create your account creation. Once you've filled in that first part, it's gonna take some information from you. It's going to ask for your phone number, the currency that you want. We're gonna choose USD and uh, your birthday, male or female, and then your address. And then this will create your account. Once you've created your account, you'll get uh, email again, and you'll be able to uh, activate your account and it'll take you to the home page, which will be this. So once you've signed up, it'll take you to the dashboard right here. You have a bunch of options on the left-hand side. You're just gonna choose on the KYC verification. This is going to verify with the broker who you are and it'll allow you to be able to upload funds once we get to the next step. So when you get to this step right here, you're gonna to have to uh, load up your ID, proof of address, and then it's gonna verify it. The verification may take uh, a couple hours, maybe a couple minutes, depending on what time of the day it is. Uh, for your ID, you're gonna to have to use a driver's license or a passport. Um, passport is probably the best. Be sure when you take a photo of it that you are taking a full photo of the photo of yourself and all the information as well as the page above it and make sure that it's very clear. You'll be able to stick it in here and you'll be able to tell what document you are using and then you can upload the document. The next part is the address. Uh, for the address to, for you to prove your address, you're going to have to use a utility bill or a bank statement, uh, either or. Be sure that it's not a screenshot of either or because uh, Hugo FX will not accept it. You need to ensure that it is a photo taken from your phone or if it's a bank statement, you download your bank statement from your online banking and you need to load up the file onto... Uh, where it says click and drag and drop proof of address here. Um, remember, if you do not do that and it is a screenshot, they will not accept it and you will have to do it properly. So just a heads up there. After you put in these two, the ID and address, it will verify and then you will get an email saying that you've been approved. And so as you can see right here, your upload created documents have been approved. Once that's happened, that's what you need to do for the Hugo FX. And uh, stay tuned for the next video where we're going to actually be able to load up the money or have funds so that you'll be able to connect them to the Hugo FX. Stay tuned.